Headline news for Thursday, June 9th from the Westchester County Business Journal, Fairfield County Business Journal, and westfaironline.com, Peter Katz reporting. The House Committee investigating the January 6th attempted coup holds its first televised hearing this evening. The primetime hearing is expected to be carried by all of the major television networks beginning at 8 p.m. Sources indicate information described as bombshells will be disclosed. A second televised hearing is planned for Monday at 10 a.m. Eastern Time. Former President Trump and his children, Donald Jr., Eric, and Ivanka, have agreed to sit for up to seven hours each for depositions in a lawsuit involving their allegedly enticing people to pay to become involved with a multi-level marketing company called ACN Opportunity. Plaintiffs in the lawsuit claim they were defrauded. The lawsuit claims that ACN was an illegal get-rich-quick scheme that violated state consumer protection laws. July 15th has been set as the date that Trump, Donald Trump Jr., and Ivanka Trump have to begin testifying in New York Attorney General Letitia James' investigation into alleged bank, tax, and insurance fraud by them and the Trump Organization. An order to that effect was signed by a state court judge yesterday. However, the order does give the Trumps the right to appeal. Rafael Grossi, Director General of the UN's International Atomic Energy Agency, told a news conference in Vienna this morning that Iran is removing 27 surveillance cameras from nuclear sites. He said that the surveillance cameras allow the UN to monitor Iran's activity in enriching uranium, a process necessary for building nuclear bombs. President Biden and Vice President Harris have been meeting with leaders of various countries from North and South America during the Summit of the Americas now underway in Los Angeles. In a speech to the opening session yesterday, Biden said the conference is an opportunity for nations to come together and address issues including climate change, economic development, and immigration. The European Central Bank said today that it plans to raise interest rates in response to continued inflation. Annual consumer price inflation across the 19-member European Union reached a new record high in May of 8.1%. The European Union's economy was forecast to grow at 2.8% in 2022, a sharp decline from the previous annual growth forecast of 3.7% that had been made in March. Stay in touch with the Westchester County Business Journal, Fairfield County Business Journal, and westfaironline.com.